Hello everybody, this is Abraham at Nashar Computer Services and today I'd like to show you a way to save a few bucks. I have this uh, um, Bluetooth headphone and uh, it works. In other words, there is the light and it does connect to the computer but I do not hear any sound coming out of the speaker. So I went online and I found a whole bunch of these things, really cheap. So I bought another one, took it apart carefully, and I'll show you in a minute how to do that. And uh, I actually have another one that I had the battery go bad, so I pulled the battery out. You can't find these batteries just by themselves, and if you would, it probably is going to cost you more than two bucks. But uh, I was able to get this uh, earpiece uh, for two bucks, so it, the battery cost me two bucks. I was able to fix my other one. Then uh, <coughs> I ordered actually two, and I found out that this one works. So now I want to see if the speaker in this one works, and uh, so I can make maybe one out of two. So let me show you how to open them. Uh, the whole thing is glued together. You gotta take a knife, slide it carefully about one and a half millimeters in. So look up what millimeter is if you don't know. And then carefully jam it in there. Carefully, slowly peel um, the top off. Now, if you jam it deeper, and that's what I did the first time. It's not the end of the world. Uh, you'll still be able to reassemble it. But there is one piece in there that might get broken. So just slowly, slowly, slowly. Okay, so that's the piece I'm talking about. Of course, these manufacturers like to make everything difficult, so what they did was they molded antenna into the second half. So now that I have the top half off, that's the antenna that you got to be careful now about. That's the Bluetooth. Since this uh, earpiece is still working, I'd like to do as minimum damage as possible to it. But because it cost me two bucks, well, if I break it, it's not the end of the world. But I do not want to break it. So now, the second level is actually uh, not glued, but it got snaps inside. Oh, come on. Alright, so there's the second level of plastic. And come on. Now, on this end, there is volume control buttons, and those you can break easily. So be careful. Be careful working on the side of the volume control buttons. Alright, so there is the, come on, let me have it, second level of plastic. Okay, I did damage the circuit board a little bit, but it still is together. So now, okay, there is the circuit board. And now each, this is a Motorola and it's a H680 uh, Bluetooth headphone. Okay, there is the battery and battery is probably good in this one because it's a different problem why this one was rejected. So, now the battery is glued, 
So you have to put your knife or some kind of pick right under there. Now do not puncture the battery. You want it to be sealed. Alright, so got battery carefully out. We got all right, there is the problem that I totally forgot about. Okay. And I've messed it up once and I messed it up again. It's the controls for the uh, volume controls. And they have this circuit board that goes in there and you have to pull it out. In order to pull it out, we have to push on the locks and get the buttons for the controls out first and then that circuit board slides out. Okay. Now, because I have another set, I'm not too concerned. I'll reattach. Uh, I'll check if I actually tore and it looks looks bad, but I may not have damaged it all completely. But I do have another set of this and I do have another antenna, so I'm not too concerned. But this is what you do and uh, I'll redo the speaker. Hopefully it'll work. Thank you.